started. Disclaimer. If you really, like, really want to get to know me and you want to be in my life and you want to just really, you know, be like, Brandy, yes, I need to get next to you. This is what, you know, I want to do. I want to be a part of your life. I want to be a motherfucking factor. If that's what you want to do, this is the key to me. <sighs> Wendy's has a strawberry tea. It's like some strawberry stuff in the bottom. I don't know if y'all can see that. It's like some strawberry mixture in the bottom. And they put the strawberry up to like here. And then they fill it with ice. And then they fill it with tea. And then they shake it. And then it just comes with this concoction that I love. And like... I have to savor it because it's going to be gone. I could drink like a thousand of these a day. I swear to God. So... <laughs> Really quickly, um, I was asked to talk about this as well, y'all. I really don't do celebrity news. Y'all know my things are like reviews, reviews, reviews. That's what I do in random ass blogs, but I guess this could be random. Um, August Alcina, if you don't know who he is, he's the, because I love this shit. That's him. So, August Alcina was on 106 in Park. Some chick. Because I don't know her name. I don't care. I don't like 106 in Park. I don't watch it. And she was dead wrong. So she's some chick. I don't know her name. I don't want to know her name. Some chick um, goes to ask him about Trey Songs. Nobody in this world really give a care about Trey Songs and all August Alcina's beef. Get the hell out of here. So she proceeds to ask him if they can make amends, you know, because they're so talented. I'm a cat. And he's like, so you just going to go against the grain and ask me that question, huh? And she's like, well, no, you talked about it on the radio and fans want to know, fans want to know. You ain't got to answer the question you don't want to. He was like, I won't. And that was the end of it. He started singing live for his fans, promoting his album. And Twitter and Internet and everybody's in the uproar. Now, you have some bloggers. This is why I don't like to cover stories like this, because any story that comes out, some bloggers just put up anything. They be like, oh my God, I got to get the views. So they put up a video really quickly and they just side with who's ever the more powerful. So the side that's the more powerful in this is everybody said, oh, because y'all seen this wrong. He needs to humble himself and all this other kind of stuff. Child, that ain't the side I'm on. And let me tell you why. If I come to do a 30 second interview with you. And I tell you during the interview, we are not going to discuss my personal life at all. While I am talking, you decide, so are you single? That's the personal life question I just told you not to ask me that. And you have violated the terms and conditions of this interview. And I'm upset. So for him to have that conversation with the producers of 106 in Park, the host of 106 in Park, and for him to tell them, I do not want to be, I don't want y'all to ask anything about Trey Songz. I'm going to put him on my album, you know, let's just do that. For this little girl to ask the question and him to check her like I told you not to ask me that shit. And y'all to say he being cocky and he need to, whoa. Y'all done tripped out. That was the terms and conditions of that interview, okay? Let's keep it a stack. He doesn't need to go on 106 in Park. August Alcina is everywhere, okay? Like, his following is ridiculous. Now, it might be a lot of teeny, teeny bopper little girls because he's very young. He's a young guy. But his following is really huge. He don't have to go on 106 in Park if he don't want to. And in his interview, they telling him, you know, he telling them, look, I don't want to I don't want to talk about my brother, you know, whatever. Whatever he didn't want to talk about. And for this chick to ask the question, him check her, and y'all be like, he wrong? Y'all delusional. Something wrong with y'all. I'm a realist. I tell you don't do something to me and you do it to me, you violating. Period. Cut dry in the story. I'm going to put you in your place. You have to teach people how to treat you. I said don't do it. You said do it. I'm going to correct you one time. You do it again, I ain't got nothing for you. End of story. I don't understand what's the big deal. He shouldn't have cussed her out. He did not cuss her out, people. He said... You gonna go against the grain when I told y'all not to ask me that shit? What's the big deal? I don't understand the big deal. But, you know, then again, I don't go the popular route and the, you know, the 
popular opinion. I'm not about that. I'm going to have my own opinion. I'm going to have my own mind. And August Alcina is right in this. He wasn't being cocky. He sat there and promoted his album even when he was pissed off. He sang for his fans. You did the right thing, August Alcina. I'm on your side. Y'all go look at the clip and tell me what y'all think.